Hey YouTubers, it's the FYI guy. I'm here for a golf quick tip on the learning curve. The learning curve has to do with uh, the changes, when you make changes to your swing. Anytime you make a, a, a game improvement change, you're going to be going through a learning curve. Everybody goes through it. I don't care what level you play at. You know, your shot quality is going to decrease. Your shots are going to get worse. They're going to be ugly until you work your way out of this learning curve. What I mean is, is this game is a muscle memory game, okay? It's got to be, it's got to be natural. It's got to flow. And when you make a change, your mind's thinking the new way. It's, want, it's seeing the new way, but your muscle remembers the old way. So until the two sync back up with the new way of swinging, you're going to be fighting it, okay? Hopefully it's short-lived, but some of the changes may be drastic and it may take you longer. So, you know, you got to give it time. You got to give it time for your mind and your body to sync up. And the only real way of doing that is through rep repetition. You got to do reps and reps and reps. You got to swing and swing and swing, whether it's out in the garage, backyard, in your living room, wherever you got room to swing, you got to work it out. You got to get your mind and your muscle synced together. You know, and, and you want to do this before you move on to your next game improvement. You don't want to be working on four different things because you'll, your thoughts will be all over the place and you're going to struggle with it. Keep on one game improvement, continue that until it becomes second nature becomes part of your natural swing before moving on to your next improvement. So I hope that helps.